Hello everybody, Debbie and all these guns. Welcome to another edition of Let's See If Dave Can See What He's Got On His Desk. Uh, we have a couple of things to do. We'll start with these. Uh, this is the continuation of the, uh, what's that, UK and British Islands. It's the set to commemorate the... King Charles as he relevances is for the coins we all know them by now don't we now these are from uh, 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 Jersey that's it you can probably see it better than I can this one is at uh, Sandringham House right. I'm still trying to find out how many more of these to do I should have checked on you mister and the next one same of verse, different reverse. This one's Windsor Castle. So, there's so many of the, with the castle, they have the relevant homes on. There's so many of the, there's different ones. If I can, uh, I'll dig it out, I'll let you know at some time. So, we got them. The continuation of the saga, there they are. And another saga. These are going to be harder for me to see. It's the next part of the wildlife set. And uh, these are from Guernsey. There we go. Again from Westminster. Uh, and these are the 10 P's. That one, apparently, using the cheat sheet because it's easier to read. That's a sand lizard. Hmm. Sand lizards on that one. That one, see, cheat sheet, is a smooth snake. Well, I was led to believe they were all smooth, but never mind. The smooth snake. I think these would have been better in colour in some respects, but uh, I wasn't uh, paying out all that money for a set of coloured coins. I'll put the cheat sheet down there. Next one. Uh, out comes the cheat sheet again. That's a common lizard, apparently. Oh, there you are. I think these are probably the worst the ones I've seen because I mean, there's no definition in these. Are there's, there's too small of a creature to be putting on a coin. And a grass snake, I mean, come on. Uh, they're just squiggly lines on coins now. This set is getting beyond a joke. Next one. Another snake. An adder. It's uh, obverses are all the same. Reverse is a difference. That one's probably an adder. And then, the last one. Like I say, that's a slow snake. Oh, slow worm. I think these are just getting out of hand now. Uh, like I've said in the past, what I'm going to start putting on next different types of grass. Never mind, I've started the set, I'll carry on with them, but they are expensive. And lastly, and one of the things I'm most excited about, uh, uh, a little bit of silver. It's a latest one from the Romans. Uh, it's a one ounce silver bar. Three, uh, sorry, four nine silver. And the Romans, King Cipher, and if memory serves me right, that's the uh, silver content there. I just can't see it properly. And on this side, look at that. We've got the uh, crown in the middle, and uh, around the outside, we've got the Lion of England. 
Unicorn of Scotland. And I think that's Irish Elk of Wales. Um, Irish Elk of Wales. Uh, Irish Elk for Ireland. And that side, the Welsh Dragon. Do apologise if I've offended anyone with that one, but yeah, you don't laugh at me. But that, I'm very happy with that. Um, so that's it, that's Dave's desk. Some coins that he's not really happy about because of the, I mean, that, that is pathetic now. Squiggly lines on coins. I've got the, uh, that set there that's coming on nicely. I'll have to get them all together in one big uh, folder and throw them up at some point. And a bit of silver for the collection. So that being said, appreciate you watching. As always, please stay safe, take care, and hopefully we'll see you next week. Bye-bye now.